All right, so what we did was we created this, I say we, but I meant, I mean Tim, created this top dead center stop. And uh, I guess what I failed to video was what we did was we went 21 degrees um, short on the intake stroke and then 21 degrees short on the exhaust stroke. Is that right? Retarded in past top dead center, retarded and past top dead center advanced. Okay. 21 degrees. So then that's how we basically figured out a um, top dead center exactly. Then we backed this bolt out to where it was flush, to where this was going to be flush um, on our created top dead center stop. And when we dialed it up to top dead center, it came out to, to zero at top dead center. So now we can take this off. We don't need it anymore. You know, right where top dead center is at. Right. So next is what, figuring out at what degree the cam is at, at max lift? Yeah. Well. So this, our, the cam that I ordered, where's my cam card? So the cam that I ordered is a, is a 112 LSA with a 110 intake center line. So it came with two degrees of timing advanced. And that's what we're going to try to duplicate when we degree this cam. Just, we're, just to uh, make sure that is that the cam was ground right. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, and it is a custom ground cam. That's really so. When Tim talked me into doing this, um, it's usually when he talks me into stuff, it's always for the better. So, um, he talked me into doing this because you don't spend the kind of money that I spent putting this engine together to not go ahead and take the time to degree the cam. So, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. We'll get the uh, we'll get the dial indicator hooked up. He, Tim brought all this from his shop and we'll get all that hooked up and then um, and then I'll turn the video back on. We'll go from there.